Hello friends, welcome to Rushi Apps YouTube channel. Today in this video, we are going to learn how to create your own buying and selling app in Tankable. Okay, before going inside this video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Okay, so today as I say, we are going to create our own uh, buying and selling app in Tankable and we are going to uh, do with this with the help of Tankable plus Google Sheets plus Firebase. Okay. And first of all, we can open the x.tankable.com and it will load. And you need to sign into your account. Yes. Sign into your account. Click create new project. So my project name is going to be this is a buy and sell app so bs app okay yes app so that i can create this app for oh, i need to select a category so let's keep our business okay because this is a buying and selling app so let's create okay okay now we have successfully created our project and now let's design our app okay so the screen one is going to be screen flash screen flash and screen another one screen which is known as which is known as register register and another one screen which is known as just uh explore explore and another one screen which is known as account okay okay account and another one is uh password password settings and another one screen which is used for uh yes uh, yes means screen screen publish okay which is used for selling publish and create new another one screen so which is used for whether we can use publishing screen publishing it's not publish it's publishing so here we are going to create a progress bar and then what we are going to do means now we are going to use the screen loading which is also a progress bar but it is going to load a, a data of the that uh, was done by the user and another one screen which is known as screen view okay screen view where the user is going to view the things that was clicked by the user let's come to flash screen okay what is flash screen name you know? so it's like a first screen it will tell about the app like our app name is bs app it will show the bs app then it will jump to next screen so let's add a label here so it will come into the center place so let's keep that text as bs app okay bs app and then text size is 25 and my second screen is register screen and which is having a text also i need to add another one screen okay wait it's not creating just wait for some second yes yes it was great now screen password okay check password screen check password and another one screen which is known as screen chat okay this is a common chat screen okay with the belong to the uh sales data i mean the post of the data belong to that post only we are users going to chat okay and register so in the screen register, we are going to add one label. 
and here we are going to keep this label name as going to be I mean label text which is going to be hide if you are new to our app don't forget to register and you can buy and sell of your products your products okay your products hi if you're new to our new to our app should come our app don't forget to register and you can buy and sell of your products okay so let's create one uh let's create one text input here it's not adding yes text input after this label so which is going to enter the user uh, int okay hint is going to the text input int is going to be username and i'm going to duplicate that same thing and hint is going to be uh, the user's mobile number, which is not phone number. Phone number. Or we may also use the phone. Uh, okay, phone is phone number itself. As well as we can use another one. We can duplicate another one text input, and we can keep at int has email. Okay, email address. Where the user is going to input the email address so phone number so the phone numbers keyboard type is going to be uh it's going to be numeric why right? because it's a number type right phone numbers and all so email address so email level email address a keyboard type is going to be email address okay then what we are going to do next means we are going to add one button here and user is going to add their profile pictures here for that what that what we are going to do means we are going to add one image component here it's also visible component after this label okay so this is having a image so i'm going to upload a image okay which is uh having a add kind of image okay like plus button Let I can upload that image. Yes, it's uploading. It says that it was added. Let I can select that image. Yes, it was uh, displaying here. So this is known as image one. Okay. So this button. So this button text is going to be <coughs> register. Register. Register is going to be the width is going to be absolute size and width is absolute size is going to be 200. So let's vertical a space around for the screen register. Okay, where the user can upload a profile picture, username, phone number, email address, register. Okay, then next screen is explore screen where the uh, uh, data will be displaying in this uh, screen only i mean the post of the buying and selling request i mean the selling request only okay let's add a data viewer list here okay the data viewer list or grid it's up to you only but i may also add a data viewer a grid because it will give a uh, more space in our one place on row itself so this grid item layout is going to be like this only so the title and subtitle okay and i'm going to add one label here in this explore screen okay label oh it's not adding yes we are added satisfied so this 
uh, lab is going to be known as BS app. Okay. This label is going to have a text is lib, uh, BS app. So I can add on the row here, top of the screen. So inside the row, I mean, uh, I think you all know what is row, okay? Which is a horizontal thing where you can add the things horizontally. Vertical means, I mean, the column means you can add the data and things uh, vertically, like up to down, okay? So in a row, I'm going to uh, keep this uh, horizontal alignment as left okay horizontal alignment as left and the height of this going to be content so also this uh, font size is going to be 25 and what i'm going to do next i'm going to add one uh, button so in that button i'm going to add a background image where the user is going to add their uh, 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 by clicking that add button users going to add their uh cells i mean the post request sell the request, selling request so the text is no, going to be nothing and the background color is also not going to be nothing and the background which is going to be image sand that we are already added so uh width is going to be absolute size which is 50 pixel and Absolute size for height also 50 pixels. S. See, we can see this uh, green color add button. By clicking this, you can buy the sorry sell the uh, products. Okay. Let's go to account account screen. So here users going to uh, see their their images and their details and their details and this is going to be this image is going to be something like nothing itself so better after this I can add one image here so this uh, sorry after this i can add one label here in this label i'm going to display the user's name okay for that i can give simply give user name user name user name okay so name so name this is now this will be not visible to the user for us money so another one takes this one phone number Number, number, yes, phone number and I can duplicate this again and another one label is going to be the text is going to be email address email address okay email address and what I can do next means I can keep vertically space around okay then uh, I can add one button after this email address that is uh, user can uh, delete okay. user can delete user can delete the account delete account okay. so the background color of this delete account is going to be red red yes and the width is going to be absolute size and 200 yes now we have successfully completed our account screens account screens uh account screens you uh, said with this name so password okay so here user can set their password here so i'm going to add one label here Display the uh, information. Information will be displaying here. So I'm going to add one three buttons. This is known as um, first of all, I will add three buttons. Yes, in this button one, first button after this information is going to be text is going to be 
create password create password create password and second is going to be change password and third is going to be delete password delete password okay, delete password and the background colors for the red password is going to be red and uh, with this going to be absolute size and 200 pixels for all the buttons is absolute size 200 for this also great password also absolute size and 200 okay so let's uh keep a uh, vertically space around for this okay vertically space around here it is going to display information create password change password delete password okay then what is s publish shell publish uh, self publish screen publishing screen loading Okay, this is yes publish screen for sorry screen publish. So let we can add a tools to a cell for a cell by the user. Okay, but we can see that on our next video. Okay, so let's see that on the part two of our video. Okay, so don't forget to subscribe to Rishi Apps channel and wait till the part two video is published. Okay, thank you for watching this video.